everybody so today I'm gonna show you how to fix a key fob for a Mini Cooper 2005 key just like this one this is actually my backup key I've just fixed this one a few minutes ago I replaced the battery you can check it in the link connected to this one and my replacement key has a broken button the close button it is broken, see? So I would have to put it together. I would have to solder it. So there is a five and one on this side for each button, as you can see. I'm gonna put it in position. I'm just gonna use some tape to put it on on the spot to fix it so it's not gonna move when I'm gonna do the actual soldering I'm gonna do it just like this so I'm gonna do this this part first This is not the finest soldering tool, but I'll try to do it this one. The button actually moved a little bit, so I'm gonna try to fix it again. Bear with me for a second, please. Okay, now it looks okay. I'm gonna have to be very careful not to touch the component that's right next to it. Yep, I got the first one. Not sure if you can see. I cannot zoom in. Okay. Can you see it? It's right there. Okay, so nope. It's not there, so yeah. This didn't work as planned. So I'm gonna try to do it again. actually moves quite a bit. First time didn't work but now it's right there. You see it? Yeah. I'm gonna put it right there. I'm gonna do the same with the second one. I'll take this off. Solder this one. It's it's perfect. Yep. I just have to put the key together and that's it. 
this key is actually glued, so you have to work your way around, your way around with with this kind of tool. But you have to be careful not to break any components because this kind of goes inside. Uh, no, it's like this. Okay. So yeah, it is kind of flush when you cut this, but you still gotta make sure that you don't touch anything. So that's it. I'm gonna use just regular glue, to put it together, and that's it. Thanks for watching. Yeah, Mini Cooper 2005 Key Fob.